Okay, in this tutorial we're going to talk about how to make a dashboard. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to connect to the ECU, key on, click on the dash tab, and you can see we've already predefined a dashboard for you that has boost and PSI, has a tachometer in the center here, air fuel ratio gauge, coolant temperature and Fahrenheit, variable valve timing, this is your cam degrees, throttle and percent, 0 to 100, Ignition timing, this is in degrees, and intake air temperature in Fahrenheit. But you can make exactly a customized version of this to meet exactly what you need. So let's just make a new tab. If I right click up here, go to new tab, we'll make a new, dis uh, new dashboard display. Hit OK. If you double click on the title bar, it'll maximize it. Go to this button over here where it says add gauge. Click on that. Let's select a linear gauge for now. Hit OK. Let's make this throttle. Enter. Is it okay? You can make it bigger like that. You can drag it over here. Now let's test it. So if I give it zero to one hundred percent, you can see there's warning lights, and those are programmed right now. But if we wanted to change that, right-click, customize. The high warning value right now is ninety-nine. So if we wanted to make that, uh, let's just say seventy-five percent, hit okay. Now you'll see that warning light triggers right at 75. But anytime you change warning lights like this, it doesn't affect just this display. It affects throttle percent in all of these tabs if it's in there. So keep that in mind. So let's make another gauge. Uh, another way to do it, just right click on the screen, hit add gauge. Let's select this black dial gauge down here for something different. Let's make this vehicle speed. So just type in vehicle speed and enter. Hit OK. All right. So here, so other things that you could do. Let's say you right-click on it, customize. You could change this so it doesn't say vehicle speed. Let's say it's, it says something simpler like VSS. That'll change that. You can also change these breakpoints. Right now it's going zero to 140 mile an hour. Right-click, customize. So let's say we want it to go 160. And we can change the major steps to 10, minor steps to 2, hit OK, and there you go. That's the dashboard.